Electrical cells, EMF. The potential difference between the two poles of an electric cell is defined as the work done by the known electrical force due to chemical process taking place inside the cell in moving a unit positive electric charge from a negative pole towards the positive pole. The energy gained by the unit positive charge due to the non electrical force in moving it from the negative pole towards the positive pole is called the EMF electromotive force of the electric cell. Its unit is joule per coulomb equals to volt. Internal resistance. The internal resistance of a cell is the resistance of the electrolyte between the anode and cathode. It depends on 1. The distance between the plates electrodes 2. The area and size of the plates electrodes 3. The strength of the electrolyte 4. Temperature Internal resistance decreases with increase of temperature. Internal resistance of cell can be accurately measured by using a potentiometer. Terminal voltage. When no current flows through the cell, the circuit is said to be an open circuit. In such a case, the PD across terminals, called the terminal voltage, will equal to the EMF of the cell. This is because no current flows through the electrolyte and hence there is no PD across the internal resistance, R. An ideal voltmeter connected across the terminals of a cell reads the EMF of the cell because the voltmeter draws no current due to its infinite resistance. That is, in an open circuit, terminal voltage V equals to EMF epsilon. Now, if an external resistance R is connected across the two terminals of a cell,